Welcome to a new video from Donut G Special World. Today, I will guide you to calculate the area of different classes of land use and land cover which were generated by supervised and unsupervised method in ArcMap. Here I have a false color composite image and a shape file of my study area. Then I classified this area with supervised and unsupervised method in ArcMap. Both videos are uploaded on our channel. Check this playlist and watch them. After preparing land use and land cover classification in supervised and unsupervised method, I masked those classified images with my study area and colorized them. I will show two different techniques for area calculation. One is from raster and one is from vector. Before that, please reproject this classified image and study area shapefile into projected coordinate system if those are in geographic coordinate system. In this case, this region falls under UTM 43N zone. To calculate area from raster, go to attribute table of classified image. Here you will get a column named count. This count column will show in unsupervised classification but not in supervised classification. If you clip your study area, then it will show in clipped supervised classification image. If you do this in unsupervised classification, then add a column of class name with text type. Now add a new field of area and set type as text. Select this column and right click on it. Go to field calculator. Double click on count and add that. Now multiply this value with 30 and again 30. This 30 value is for image pixel size. This satellite image is a Landsat 8 image, so the pixel size is 30 into 30 meter. If you use Sentinel satellite image, then it will be 10 into 10. Till now, this will generate area in square meter. To change it into square kilometer, divide it with 1 lakh. Your area for these classes are calculated from raster image. Now if you want to calculate area from vector file, then first convert the image into projected coordinate system. Now convert this raster image into polygon. After creating vector file, dissolve these files, grid code and symbolize them as classified image. Now add a column of area and select double S type.
go to calculate geometry and select area By this technique, you can easily calculate area from vector files.